Okay, here we are again, back again with Project Hospital. Uh, we did the first tutorial, which was just learning how to operate with or work with patients and things like that. Now, this is the second part of the tutorial, the second of three, I believe. Um, and this is actually, I guess we're going to build something um, on our own. So, it says, hi boss, we know... Uh, we." We also know that diagno diagnosing was not the only thing you did. It's not the only thing you did. You were good at building hospitals. Okay, next. So welcome to this nice property we recently acquired. Uh, let us refresh a little bit on how to build and equip your very own hospital and what option and what options there are. Okay, next. Okay, all right. Let's build a nice little clinic for a little, a little clinic first. Let's switch the building mode. You can click on the button in the top left corner of the screen or just push the F6 key. All right, let's push that button. All right. The first important step is laying down foundations. The foundations tools selected already cover an area big enough to house at least three rooms. For example, 20 by 20 tiles. One by one. Whoa. Okay, fine. One by sixteen, nineteen, twenty by twenty. There we go. Excellent. Now here's a quick summary of what's available to build. There are five main categories: foundations, constructions, doors and windows, objects, and prefabs. Okay, next. Each category is further divided into subcategories. Don't forget there's a tool tip for each category and item with more info. Okay. All right. Now that we have a place to build, now that we now that we have a place to build, we need to design our floor plan. The very basic unit of every hospital is the emergency department. Select management mode to see which rooms will will definitely need to make an emergency department operation. Okay. Boop. All right. <clears throat> List is divided between mandatory and optional rooms. Let's place one of each. A doctor's office, a waiting room, and a restroom. These are needed for a working clinic. Okay. So, what? Doctor's office. Basic clinical office for simple examination. Minimum room size four by four. Well, uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. All right. Minimum room size one, two, three, four, five. Let's go five by five. Let's go six by. Eight. Let's go six by five. All right. A waiting room. Uh, waiting room should be placed within reach of each office, lab, and radi radiology room. Minimum size four by two. Okay. Well. Well, 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 well. Let's just go. What was it? Four by. Uh, all right. Six by five. There. Waiting room. I'm a builder. Okay. And then finally, a restroom. And that's the minimum size of three by two. room where even a queen must walk. Oh, okay. Why don't we put that... What size? 3 by 2. 2 by 4. There. Well done. With the floor plan done, let's build some walls. You can find them in the building mode under construction category. 
Building mode. Construction category. Oh, let's build some walls. Build walls. Okay. White wall. Brick wall. Well, just for... Okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, wait. Oops. So if we put a wall there, we put a wall. Wait a minute. And put a wall there. And burn. Put a wall there. And put a wall there. You shall not pass. All right, put a wall there. And a wall there. And a wall there. And a wall there. Okay, great. Walls are walls are some wall great. Walls are sometimes not required for the rooms to function, but for some objects need or but some objects need to be hung on ah, hung on the wall. Alright. Choose the wall color, build the walls. Hit a line, rectangular pattern, different option tools, shown build poly panel. Okay. You can also build various types of floors, doors, and windows. Don't forget to place doors so your rooms and the building itself is accessible. When you're happy with your setup, click Next. Uh, okay. Place floors. Uh, laminate flooring. Okay, we'll do that. Oops. Do that there. Black floor. Colored tiles. Light tinted tiles. Well, I'll just do that there. There. And medium white ceramic tiles. We'll just put that right there. Okay, now what? Build pillars. Ambulance, elevators, doors and windows. <clears throat> oh, it's going to be a hard game for me, I'll tell you right now. It print really pretty small. Okay, a white door. Fine. There. Oh, we'll put one here in the restroom. There. And then I guess we have to put... Oh. Uh, back to walls. I guess we need to put... Wall up there. we need to continue this wall down to there and I suppose we should continue this wall oh wait what there to there and from there to there and from there to there. Uh, <clears throat> Oops, wrong way. And doors.
I get there. We'll just put one of them. Oops. How about one of those right there? Okay. Build various types of floors, doors, and windows. Don't forget to place doors. So your rooms, the building itself is accessible when you're happy with yourself. Okay, go. Next. Let's focus on furnishing some of the rooms. Click on the simply click on the floor of any of the rooms. Okay. Panel shows the furniture and equipment that is either mandatory, orange or recommended yellow for the room. Mandatory items show also alternatives. For example, all equipment cabinet. For example, all equipment cabinets. But you'll need only one. You can rotate objects by pressing R or the middle mouse button. Okay, so we gotta have that. And oops, nope. R R R R R There. Okay. Uh, what else we got here? A sink. I'll put that there. And a hand dryer. Okay. Waiting room. Okay, gotta have a bench. Well, I don't have any. Um, info TV. Okay, Q machine. I'll put that there. The info TV. We'll put it right there. And then we'll put benches. Yeah, fine. And rotate those. Ooh. Gotta go over a little bit. And we can put bench there. And bench there. And rotate. There, there, rotate, there, there. Maybe this needs to be there. Okay. <sighs> okay. Mandatory orange. All right, so oops, too far. Up, up. Okay, so mandatory. All of this is mandatory. Okay, exam table. And no, 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 no. Put it there, I guess. And what's this? Audio meter. Well, I think that's okay. Medical light. There. Um. Biohazard trash bin. Let's just put that in the corner. Okay, there were two different ones. All right, and paper, paper holder. All right, put a desk in here somewhere. Uh. Okay. If we put it. There. Now, yeah, can we put it in an office chair? Yes, we can. 
All right, that's making me nervous. All right, then we need the sink, which we can put like maybe right there. Okay. And an eye test. Put it right there. PC. Right there. Walmart printer. We'll put that right there. Equipment cabinet. How about right there? Audio meter. Put that right there. And then how about the equipment table? Right there. And that right there. So we got everything that's required. I guess. Maybe. I don't know. Still seems a little scary, but... Okay, next. Oh, okay. Right mouse, button, right, but, right mouse button cancels current selection sub-objects. Need to be additional equipment to work. If the object in the scene is tinted blue, you can hover over it or over the, or the floor under it and see what other equipment it needs. It will be blue in the equipment panel. Well, everything looks good there. Okay, next. Optional equipment usually contains decorations or objects that don't serve any particular purpose in the given room, but in, excuse me, improve the environment. Okay. Now we need to be a functional clinic. Is for is do it is is a doctor. We will hire one with the help from our game tutorial. These are also available in sandbox mode. Select in game tutor tutorial. Hiring new staff. Okay. Select the management staff. All right. Click on the staff button. That be it? Nope. <sighs> Click on the staff button. Trash, move, no. What? Where? Click on the new staff button. Um. Oh, there's lots of stuff there. Uh, furniture, decorations, lights, decals. Prefabs, construction, game mode. All right, I'm not seeing. Click on the new staff button. Well, where? All right, next. Choose what profession you need. Employees. No, that's not what I want. Oh, there we are. Didn't tell me about that part. Okay, hire new staff. What profession you need? No special hover over the mouse on the management panel on the green tool tip. Alright, what? Hire doctors. Okay. Next. Choose day or night shift. Day. Next. Holy coal. Well, let's see. Alright.
Select the required character, place them in the room where, where you want them to work. Oh, there we are. Okay. After a tip after placement, the character will automatically find the nearest workspace. Okay. Done. When you have more departments, you can switch between them using the icons in the main panel. Select radiology department and open the management mode again. All right. Uh, check what rooms you need for functional radiology department. Build, equip, and staff them. All the red warning signs must be dealt with. The particular I forget. Yeah. Okay. A waiting room, restroom, X-ray room. X-ray room. Minimum five by five. Well, this is this. I wasn't quite ready for that, but all right. So let's go over here. And let's see. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Six by five. Done. What? Wait, what? There's that. There's a restroom. Fine. We'll build another restroom. And we'll make it a small one. Well. There. Alright. Plug on the equipment. Need the water closet. Need the... Need the hand dryer. Oh, whoops. And we're just going to do white walls for now. Because this is just a tutorial. And we're just learning how to do this. Okay. All right. Click on this again. Hand dryer. Put it there. Let's put in a sink. Um, there. That's all there. This. What do we need? Okay. We need x-ray. Um, okay. We'll put that there. What else we got here? Equipment cabinet there. X ray viewer, X ray control. Um, there, I guess. X ray. Office desk, that work. PC. Check what rooms you need to be for functional radiology department. Build, equip, and staff them. All right. So, go back here. 
radiology, hire staff. Now, who is this? Biochemistry. Now, we need nurses, doctors. Hmm. Biochemistry. Radiology. All right, we'll just take Brooke here. And... Oh, never mind. Sorry. Go back to construction. We need to have... A door. And a door. There. Okay, now I'll go back to... Brook. Just drop. Oop. What's going on? Oh, and a waiting room. <clears throat> I'm not done yet. Stop it. Waiting room. We need that. That. And no, there. Now go ahead and finish the last objective to treat six patients. <sighs> Hospital now accepts patients. Okay, there we are. Here we go. goodness oh okay I see something else that we could do here furniture would be nice to have the patient have a chair Yes, it would. <clears throat> okay. One. Or two, actually. X-ray. Treated to three. <laughs> Getting there. I mean, yes, there is other stuff we could be putting in here, but just for the tutorial, uh, putting in a receptionist or uh, uh, vending machines, um, things to occupy patients' time. <clears throat> okay, well, we did that. 
Before we finish, let's have a look at the last category and a great time saver, prefabs. Select the prefabs category in the building mode. Okay, prefabs. Now you can see the different rooms divided by departments. Choose any of the prefabs and place it in an unoccupied area in your clinic. Uh, 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 what's this? Darker's office, darker's office, restroom, what's this? What was that? Internal medicine, restrooms, common room. Place hospital staff to rest, study, and eat. Okay, we'll do that. Wow. Beep. That's pretty big. How about that? Restroom, restroom, common room, cleaning closet, on-call room, nurse's station, nurse's station, on-call room. That's locked. That's all locked. That's keg. There. You now placed a fully equipped room. It's also automatically added to the floor plan. You, of course, modified exactly to your needs. Okay. Well done. It's easy as riding a bike, isn't it? Next. Hmm. Well, there you have it. <clears throat> as we're learning how to do this. I uh, hope you're enjoying it. hope you're learning something. I can see that this game may be fun for me, but it also, because of the small print, uh, the old eyes just aren't what they used to be. So, I don't know. We'll play through the next... Uh, we have one more tutorial, I believe. We'll play through that. And we'll see how it goes after that. And uh, see what kind of things to do. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, hope you're learning something. Taking a look at it, whether you want to actually buy it, get get this or not. Um, I thank you for watching. And we'll see you in another video in the near future.